and welcome back to the channel on this video I'm going to be writing the lyric graffiti as you see it right there this is the original lyric graffiti and could this bike soon be uh, considered an illegal bike electric bike in California well let's talk about it right now let me hop on and we'll talk a little bit about what I'm talking about Okay, so so California recently passed a new law in the Senate for electric bikes. This is the SB 1271 law and basically it's about class levels of e-bikes. And this is in the state of California. And if you're not familiar with class levels, what they mean, the class one, two, and three, which is what uh, California has and many states have. I think it's 43 states exactly. But uh, let's go over uh, what the uh, class levels mean first before I move on with what this law is. Uh, uh, what they're trying to get into law uh, okay so first class one is a bike electric bike that is capable of going 20 miles per hour top speed and there's no throttle on the bike it's pedal assist only so you're getting up to 20 miles per hour maximum speed on pedal assist only no throttle on the bike class two very similar, uh, 20 miles per hour, same speed, except for you have the option of throttle or pedal. You have both. Then you come to class three, and class three is pedal assist and throttle, but the trick is here, throttling up to 20 miles per hour, and if you want to go beyond 20 miles per hour, you are pedaling only so it's pedal assist after 20 miles per hour but you can throttle up to 20 miles per hour throttle only so those are the three class levels so now what they're doing or what they're proposing they've already passed the senate so it's up to the governor uh, Gavin Newsom of California to uh, pass this and if it gets passed then this will become law and if it gets vetoed, then we're back to the way it was, what I just mentioned. So what they're proposing is to eliminate in class one and class three bikes, eliminating that throttle. So in class one, there's already no throttle. But uh, so I don't know if that's really changing anything there because if there's no throttle on the bike anyway, then it's no different. But class three, um, they're saying, uh, the, the proposal is saying no throttle at all on the bike. It can't have a throttle. It's no longer defined either class one or class three, uh, an electric bike, if it's got a throttle on those class levels. So, but they're going to leave class two alone. It's going to remain like it is now, where you have a throttle and uh, pedals uh, for pedal assist. You can use either one and the maximum speed is 20 miles per hour. Personally, I don't like it because I don't know if you're going 20 miles an hour or 28 even, what's the difference whether you're pedaling to the 28 or you're throttling to the 28, you're going 28 miles per hour. It doesn't matter to me. It doesn't make a difference. You're still going that speed. And uh, so that's, you know, I don't like it. I, I, think, it, I think it stinks, uh, literally. And, uh, and the reason why I wanted to bring this up too is because if one state passes this, like California, then you know others are going to follow suit. 
because that's generally how it works. So we'll have to see, keep an eye on this and see where it goes. And this happened a few weeks back. I uh, just got wind of it today, actually, reading up on it. I didn't even realize that this has gone as far as it has there. And uh, so I thought I'd bring it out uh, uh, onto the channel uh, and get other people to see this if they didn't already. And maybe ask your opinion, what do you think of it? No throttle on class one or class three bikes. And class two remains with the throttle maximum speed 20 miles per hour. I think they're also leaving the power. It looked like uh, I read they're leaving the power still at 750 watts. You know, I don't even know if that's maximum or continuous. I don't know. If somebody knows what uh, the 750 watts is, does that mean sustained? Or is that maximum? Anyway, we'll keep an eye on this law and see where it goes. If it gets passed into law or gets vetoed. But it's now in the governor of California's hands. It did pass the Senate. So that's going to do it for this video. I just wanted to get out and uh, do a little ride and talk a little bit about e-bike laws and in this case California. And this one kind of worries me a little bit as an e-bike rider. But we'll see. We'll see where it goes. I just don't like the fact that you can pedal 28 miles per hour but not throttle makes no sense to me if you're going to go 28 like I say miles per hour what's the difference I don't know anyway that's going to do it for this video if you like this video go ahead and hit the like button if you'd like to subscribe to the channel thank you very much for supporting us just hit the subscribe button and If you uh, want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell. And if you want to comment, maybe you have a comment on this video here on this topic, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. And once again, thank you for joining me on this video. And until next time. Keep your wheels on the road. See you later.